shoplifters. Um, today I didn't really record a lot of stuff because I basically just did my high pulls, which I mostly recorded, except I think uh, the warm up sets. And it's not going too well uh, because I feel like I kind of regressed since last week I didn't really do them. Um, but I feel like that I kind of got back at the point where I was at least two weeks ago. Um, it's kind of hard to do them and I really need to start thinking of, uh, of my hips as basically like a, a launch platform where those are basically uh, blasting a lot of energy into the bar and the traps are just kind of pulling up but they aren't really pulling. They are basically just um, channeling the energy produced by the hips uh, into the bar in order for the bar to go up in a straight line. Um, I basically, as I said, did my high pulls and then I just did all of my mobility stuff which I don't really feel like it's interesting since you already know what I do and I don't really want to just have a long video in which I talk about, about nothing so I just wanted to keep it extremely short and this is pretty much what I did I uh, also noticed that I used uh, the Olympic shoes um, and I really liked, liked them because I really tended to kind of smash my heels into the ground uh, and these kind of help with reducing kind of, not the recoil but in general the energy that went through my whole body um, another thing that I feel like that I'm doing wrong a lot is basically how I'm gripping the bar because it's really inconsistent like the grip here is decent but if you look at like the previous clip you could clearly see that one hand was lower than the other and even now when I pull uh, look at my arms they are in a different position and I don't understand if it's because of my shoulder mobility or it's if it's because of the way I'm gripping or if it's because of some, something else. Uh, however, high pulls are a really nice exercise, you know, it really feels like I'm doing cardio, you know, uh, hit cardio in particular, you know, like sprinting and then resting. And I really enjoy them, I really, really do. Uh, you might want to try to use them in your training. Uh, I would probably put them ideally in a pull day if you don't have too much stuff or if you already have pretty packed pull days like I do you might want to actually uh, put them in a leg day, definitely not in a push day. You see here I kind of try to mimic the movement just to see where my hands end up going, but you can see that the whole position is compromised from the bottom. So I think that doing some weighty before doing the high pulls for my left arm can help. Uh, there we go, look at that. <laughs> it was fun, you know, it's a fun movement to do. Uh, you know, I really think Olympic weightlifting can be a really fun sport. However, I really don't have the mobility, nor the time, nor the will, uh, since, you know, I like bodybuilding and I like doing everything by myself. But it really seems fun. It really seems fun to be catching weight overhand, um, you know, and lifting it up. Anyway, this is it for today's video. See you guys in the next one.